everybody, and welcome back to BeamNG.Drive. This episode, we will be going over Insane Gaz's uh, ultimate insane testing map, which he built a, uh, a rally cross track on, which I have been trying to drive on for, like, ages now, and I swear I can never get it right. Uh, he made, like, a whole, uh, a whole video on, on the, uh, on the, uh, track, and it was pretty cool, actually. He, he timed it up with some music, he was able to, uh, get some nice shots, and my driving skills just quite aren't up to par with his. I have a feeling he has a few hundred more hours of BeamNG under his belt than I do. Uh, now that being said, this game has undergone many brand new and amazing features since the last time I reviewed it. Uh, the first being I finally know how to go out of the car for the camera now, which is really cool because you can, uh, you can watch your uh, cars and totally not know how to drive them because you're not actually like on them. Uh, also, uh, the terrain just looks beautiful now. They fixed some of the issues with the graphics popping in and out, which it had before, which looked actually horrible, but I mean, it's not that bad anymore. Um, let's go back to the car. Uh, this is a modded car. This is actually included in the game. The link will be in the description. It's called, I believe, let's see if I can uh, look it up, the VW Polo RWRC, and I'm using the Gravel Edition, uh, just because I, I can, and I guess this is sort of like a gravelly path. And also... Uh, there's a new menu, um, and the pre-race update's almost out, so, yeah, we're just gonna be, uh, taking this, uh, car out on this path. I really hate to try to destroy it. This is actually quite a long, uh, what, what would you say, a, a rally cross? Well, I don't know. I've never actually, uh, done or watched much racing in my life, but I assume that it would be, uh, not, well, maybe it is as long as this. I have no idea, actually. Uh, I know nothing about racing. This game is basically my introduction into, into a lot of racing. So, but generally, the just hardest thing about this map is predicting how far you're going to have to turn for the corners. I mean, some of them, like that turn, aren't particularly hard. Uh, the first time I played this, though, I, like, was crashing constantly. There was no way I could complete half these turns. Look at that. I just, I sort of clipped that. It's like, I'm unconfident in myself about whether I need to go or not, so I kind of just, you know, uh, I, I usually just overdo it, or I underdo it, and then I... It just, it just ruins. It's not because the times I am confident about the decision I'm making, I'm usually wrong. So then the car just uh, just usually crashes. Uh, this track, I have actually played this uh, track more than I think anything else in this game. Uh, I've really just, I mean, over the last couple days, I, I moved this over to Steam. Yes, there's uh, now uh, Steam uh, support for the game. Oh crap! Oh crap! This could be the end of us. You, uh, that doesn't look so hot. Uh, Talk about some serious damage going on right there. Uh, not sure how well our steering is doing. That could be uh, questionable, although I have a feeling we're not going to make it past the big jump, and we'll probably either have to start again, or I'll have to uh, drive us back out. Holy crap, that was the jump over a river, which I was totally actually expecting. I kind of just forgot about it. Oh, this, this is taking a lot of my concentration. Some of these hills get pretty big as, uh, as the map goes on. Um, I'm actually doing quite well for, uh, for the other times I've done this. I guess I've, I just getting used to it. I think I've watched Insane Gaz's video enough uh, that I know how to do a lot of this. You've got to take it slow, you know? You can't just hold down the acceleration the whole time and uh, and act like uh, you're some sort of driving boss, because, you know, not everybody is a driving boss. Actually, speaking of driving, uh, I signed up for uh, driver's education today, so uh, soon I will be on the roads and terrorizing citizens of Wisconsin. That's always nice to know. If you live in Wisconsin, just make sure you, uh, you watch out for me. My license plate will probably say, like, Dodge them on it or something, like Dodge, maybe. Maybe that's probably taken. It'll probably say, like, Goose Honk or something. Maybe it'll say Star. I have no idea what I'm going to do with that. That's some uh, beautiful water over there. I also looked into how to actually make maps for BMG, and it's not that hard. Uh, I think I could uh, get a handle on it. I think I could make a map. Uh, maybe like a rally like this. Oh crap, that could be the end of us. Oh, pull, don't fall off the hill! Don't fall off the hill. Uh, okay, okay, well, oh, I'm, tr I'm trying to do this all in one go. Okay, let's see if I can just spin this around and uh, and we can start over again. Uh, not start over, but we can just get around this corner. We're losing parts of the car and uh, fast succession. Uh, there's a lot of other stuff on this map too, besides um, this rally track. There's also a whole bunch of tubes and there's a bunch of stuff to destroy your cars with. I, I really recommend you actually get this map. It's great to just have loads of fun. I haven't even tested all the features out and I've been playing this for days. Uh, this rally track, though, is really just bothering me because I've never actually been able to complete it in one go, so... Oh, this is going to require some power, isn't it? Oh, come on! Make it, car! Make it! Make it! Oh, yeah! Look at that! Oh, yeah! Oh, crap. Oh, I'd feel bad for anyone who was actually driving this. Ooh, that didn't look too good. Oh, 
we're gonna lose something important. We're gonna lose a wheel or something, and we're gonna be out of this. Oh crap, it's the jump. It's the jump. There ain't no way I can do this jump. Um, uh, you'll, you'll see what I mean uh, when you see the jump. There, there ain't, uh, there isn't eight. There isn't no way I can complete this jump. Uh, actually, I, I can't even make it to the jump without spinning out of control. Oh. Uh, okay, that's, that's always very promising. Very promising. Oh, uh, crap, no, I spun that the wrong way. There we go. Okay, let's get this. Okay, we just gotta line ourselves up, and then we gotta gun it straight up this hill. Uh, the fat, the, the, the fact of the matter, no. The problem is, though, is that our car is veering to the right quite severely. Uh, this could be just the car's nature, or it could be the fact that, uh, the car is heavily damaged. But, uh, now it's basically destroyed. Yeah, oh, no, what? Is it drivable? Is it? No, it's, it's no longer drivable either. Um, nah, that's too bad. And there's no way out of this hole, so... Yeah, I guess we kind of failed at this. I do have a spawn point set back at the start, in case I needed to try over again, which I am doing right now. I'm not actually sure which way this track goes. I may be able to take a shortcut right here, and then and then we can just skip over that part. I, I could be wrong. This could be a, a long cut. Um, I have no idea. Oh, I have to make this jump. Oh, these are some hard jumps. Yeah, I think that I'm actually uh, cheating. Yeah, that's great. I'm already cheated. Uh, Let's go, we can make this. Ah, oh, yeah, we totally made that. Uh, oh, just the jump right there, okay. That's very uh, convenient, yeah. Uh, I'm not actually sure that I can make that jump. Was that, was that behind us? In front of us? No, that was to, to the side. Uh, okay, so if we just do that, and then we get on over here, and then we spin around, and we go over here. Oh yeah, okay, so we gotta get some speed up, so. We just gotta go this way, and then we're gonna turn around, and we're gonna try to do that jump again. Okay, we can do this. And sorry that the game volume has turned down so far, it's just that the ambient effects of this map are so insanely loud, I could not even hear myself think. Nor could you guys actually hear my, the, uh, the microphone over uh, the ambient sounds. I, I guess Insane Gas does need to do some fixing up with the ambient sounds, or otherwise some people might not be happy with that. And we're doing the jump, and we're still not gonna make it. Yeah, I, as I said, I, I'm not that good at doing this uh, jump. Uh, okay. Um, I wonder if there's a way to like completely skip past. I like uh, the first thing I do with the map is I just begin cheating because because like I cannot complete it. Well, I can't complete the map. Eventually, I mean I'm, I'm spinning out of control like like all of these times. Ah, come on! I can't already be destroyed. That's uh. I wonder. I wonder if you can do this track in reverse. Actually, uh, probably not since the jump is only one way. Um, uh, I've always wanted to try it in reverse though. See, again, I'm already I'm already going off. The topic of what uh, we were supposed to be doing here. Oh uh, yeah, look at this hill. Oh uh, yeah, it's so much easier to complete reverse. Uh, I say that now, and then I'm probably going to spin out really soon. Actually, it should be about the same difficulty to complete in reverse. I'm not sure. Uh, we sort of didn't make that that one. Oh, so this jump is actually almost basically the end of the, uh, the end of the whole thing, which is nice. Uh, so yeah, um, obviously there's no way I can uh, finish this uh, really thing uh, because I'm not that good at driving. At least in this game. I, I guess if I rack up enough uh, hours of driving, this will be really easy to do for me. But, um, yeah, now, now I, I think it's not a good time for me to complete stuff like this. So, uh, we should probably look around the, uh, the map as well, um, besides this. Uh, if we go back, if we reverse here, we can get over to some of the other things on the map, which include objects like a road. Look at this road. It's very beautiful. And we got, let's see, if I get out of here, I'll let the car just kind of spin out of control. We've got these tubes, which you can go down, and they're quite fun. Uh, we have whatever that is. It's uh, No Brains Hill. Um, I've went down that before. Uh, we have this giant stairway of death, that uh, weird thing, which I played at the carnival. Uh, I don't I don't actually think I've, I've seen that before. And this spiky death trap, which is always much fun to play with. And I, I don't really know what this stuff is. I've, I've never actually use this ramp before. What the heck is going on with this? It's kind of strange, actually. Anyway, let's get back to the car. Uh, it's surprisingly still going. And we'll go and test out some of these brand new features. Okay, so here we are at the top of these giant tube things. I'm gonna go down the, uh, the weird one with no top first. Just because I think, uh, this is a fun thing to play around with. Yeah, look at that. We're driving on the wide, and then we're driving here. Oh, it's like a slalom. It's like we're doing skiing or something. Oh, look at that amazing turn I just made. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Oh, and we're spinning out of control. And 
And the next thing you know, we're gonna be stuck. Oh no, we flip back over again. Okay. We go down. Uh, we go down straight, and we're gonna go off the side. Let's go off the side. Yeah, look at the car. It's totally soft body physics being destroyed and shot everywhere. Yeah, amazing. Okay, let's go back to the reset point up here. And uh, we're obviously using arcade automatic mode for driving. Since again, I don't know too much about driving. This is usually the part where I get wedged in some sort of cube or something. No matter how many times I try to do this. Oh yeah, oh yeah, okay, okay, no, 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 this looks bad, this looks very bad, this looks- oh. Oh, okay, that's not too bad, as long as we can start, uh, no, we're not landing up. Um, never mind, okay, let's restart that. This cube is like some sort of a death trap, I'm, I'm convinced. I'm not sure who would uh, put a massive cube there. Look, I'm already taking damage, and I'm not even going the, uh, yeah, okay, there, I just messed up backing up again. That happens, especially when you're me. Okay, let's try that board. What the heck is going on? I think uh, my steering is shot. That happens. Okay, um, bad. Okay, now we're just veering to the left. And now we're landing upside down on the back. And now we're rolling. And now I'm restarting. Okay, let's try that again. Okay, it's time we gotta enter smoothly. Okay, there we go. It smoothly. Okay, and now we turn out of the way of that little cube, which will like take out a tire or five. Okay, now we aren't supposed to be standing this down, but actually that saved us. And then we get that giant thing. And now our back wheels are sort of messed up. Come on, we can make it to the bottom. There we go. Look at that. We made it to the bottom, even though our back wheels are like facing some strange direction. That's always so much fun. Let's see if we can do that without taking a whole ton of damage, though. Okay, 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 we got that. Oh crap, we're spinning out of control, and... Oh, uh, oh one of our tires shot off. I went over that one. Uh, it went over there. Look at that, it's still balancing around. It's having a heavy hop time. I also uh, figured out some uh, some new features with the game, too, which which might make this, uh, this tube a little bit easier for us. So, if I turn on the parking brake, I can go look at the settings of the game. Now, let's see, we got vehicle debug terrain environment. Oh, sorry, not effects. Environment, look at that. Simulation speed, there's a slider for that. And gravity, ooh, this looks fun. We can uh, we can lower the gravity just a little bit uh, to make it uh, less uh, difficult for us to uh, complete the uh, the turns. Oh crap, I didn't mean to do that. Uh, we are in real time, correct? Yeah, this, the gravity is so low, I'm, I'm not really touching the ground all that much. Either that or it's too high, I'm not really sure which. We are going real time, yeah. Look, I'm crap, I'm moving. Come on, let's go, let's go, let's go. I didn't mean to reset, I didn't mean to reset, I didn't mean to reset. Come on. Come on. Why is everything, oh, maybe, oh crap, did I, did I touch that? No, it's simulation speed one. Okay, apparently it, it got stuck or something. It doesn't feel like real time to me. Okay, here we are. We're on our, uh, thing, is that, okay. I'm. Whoop.